The most common surgical procedure for people who are over the age of 65 is cataract surgery. Cataracts are described as abnormalities in the eye. Often they can lead to blindness. Removal of cataracts can be expensive. Here to talk more about cataracts and what it is that causes them is Dr. Brent Reed of Griffin and Reed Eye Care. Good afternoon to you. Hi, Deidre. How are you? I'm doing just fine. I see you, you brought along a little uh, demonstration I, for us. I brought a model eye because one of the problems with cataracts is most people have a misconception about what a cataract really is, much less what, what can be done about it. So which part of the eye are we talking about Well, here? when we look inside an eye, a human eye, as you can see in cross-section, the part of the eye that becomes cataractus or the cataract Let's itself. It this way. Okay. Let me help people get a good idea. So you can see that it's this lens inside the eye that actually becomes clouded. Most people have the misconception that they, a growth on the front of the eye is what, you know, is what a cataract is, when really it's just the lens that we're born with that as time and life goes by it becomes more milky and yellow that causes these uh, these changes in our vision. Now is that something that if I had that is that something you would visually see or is it something that really just the patient is going to notice these changes in vision? It would be it's something good. that you would have a difficult time seeing when you looked at someone as we're looking at each other mm -hmm. right now because it was it's behind the pupil itself the black hole and as a result of it not uh, if it being behind there you wouldn't see much but the patient would see an increase in glare uh, increase in, uh, decrease in their ability to read uh, well and decrease in their ability to do normal daily functional tasks. Okay, we're looking at some video now. Uh, now, is this giving us an, eye, uh, an idea this of, of picture, what they look like? This is a picture of a, a cataract surgery and the lens implants actually being folded and put into the eye in the place of where the, uh, the uh, cataractus lens used to sit. Uh, have we changed the way we treat cataracts? We have. We've changed it remarkably over the last 15 years since I started doing this surgery and training. And uh, now we do it through a tiny incision in about 12 to 15 minutes with a high frequency sound wave that most patients think is a laser, but it's not. Interesting. Now, um, why is it that it seems to hit so many people after the age of 65? Why is that the trigger time for so many people? It's mainly because of the fact that as, pe as we grow older, the uh, dose in the accumulated uh, amount of ultraviolet radiation that we uh, absorb over the years causes the lens to yellow and become milky. And it's a normal aging process. In fact, if we all lived long enough, we'd all develop cataracts significant enough to need cataract surgery. I recall being a kid and my grandmother going through that in both eyes. Is that something that genetically people are predisposed to? There is a genetic predisposition to earlier onset cataracts. Most people that have cataracts that develop in their 70s and 80s uh, are those kind of cataracts that we would normally get from environmental exposure. But if you have cataracts in your family in, in 40s and 50s, you have to be aware that that may also be a problem for you. Does it often turn up in younger people? It does in, in people who are on steroid uh, medications. Uh, diabetics tend to get them earlier in life. Someone who's had trauma uh, to either eye will tend to get cataracts earlier in life. Those are all situations in which you have to be aware you may get them earlier than otherwise. Real quickly, you mentioned ultraviolet light as being yes. a cause as well. Uh, is that just another argument for Another eye great protection? argument to wear sunglasses that have full UV protection when you're outside. All right, thank you very much, Dr. Reed. Appreciate you coming my in pleasure. and bringing your friend. Yes, <laughs> my friendly eyeball. Uh, you always have fun things in your office, I'm sure. We do. All right, thanks very much, 2020. That's right. <laughs>